Hello, good morning. Today I'm going to cook chicken rendang. I use four chicken thigh and cut uh, each thigh. I cut it into three pieces, so I have about maybe equivalent to the whole chicken. So I have marinated the chicken with about one tablespoon of salt and put it in the fridge for about twenty minutes. These are the ingredients I'm going to blend. You can look out in the list of the ingredients below this um, video. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to cut up all these uh, ingredients and put in the blender. I have about half a cup of chili. Put in half a cup of water to help in the blending process. Okay, then so I'm going to blend it. I'm going to boil potato first. I've already cut the potato here. One tablespoon of salt, just put it in. After 10 minutes, I need to check my potato. Yeah, potato is soft already. I'm going to uh, remove from the hot water. This is a roast, roasted coconut that I bought from the cake shop. So, <laughs> this is the fastest way that I don't have to fry it. So, I just found. Be okay now. Yep, that is our roasted coconut. Karasi. I use three spoon of this soup spoon of oil. I'm putting in the kalangal pieces about three pieces and kapia lime leaves and also the uh, lemon grass adding in the um, mixture of all the ingredients that we have blended Smells so good. So, I let it cook in here for uh, about uh, ten minutes or so. Continue to stir until the paste has released the oil. Put in a one teaspoon of salt. So I'm going to put in all the chicken, turmeric, uh, turmeric leaves, just um, crush a little bit, okay, put in. Okay, once I add in the chicken, I'm going to reduce the heat to and set the time for about half an hour, let it simmer. I right, you should use the palm sugar, but today I do not have the palm sugar, so I'm just using the um, brown sugar. Just put in about two tablespoons of uh, brown sugar. We will let the chicken simmer inside here. We'll cover the lid. After almost half an hour, chicken is already cooked. I'm going to taste this. Oh, 
kind of spicy. So, a bit lack of salt. I'm going to put in a quarter teaspoon of salt. Okay, now I'm going to continue to cook with the low fire with another 10 minutes that I'm going to add in the potato and other ingredients. Okay, this is the coconut, roasted coconut that we put. So, I think I don't want to put all. I'm adding in the potato that we have boiled earlier. I'm adding in one box of coconut. Okay. I'm going to let it continue to cook. I'm putting in um, half of the onions, onion rings. Just for the love of onion, just put it in. Just let it continue to cook for another 10 minutes. Okay. After about 10 minutes or so, so the, the gravy is drying up, so I don't want it to be so dry. I'm going to switch off the heat. So that's done for the chicken rendang. Kaffir lime leaves and also the turmeric leaves. 